All right. So routes, set route, uh, set. <clears throat> Set routes. Press options. Uh, press uh, press options button to open the map. Then press X at your destination. Select mission on the map and pre press square to view chapters. Use left stick to scroll through available objectives. Okay. Uh huh. Story chapters. Chapters, missions, and objectives. So there's gonna be multiple content in this game. That's gonna be nice. Very nice. So Sammy's doing all right. Ever since we got your telegram about coming home, he's been climbing the walls. What if the plane crashes? What if the train's delayed? What if they Ooh. come back? And he goes stand in front of the kitchen window and sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. I was ran right over that bitch. Don't say nothing about me telling you that. I won't. He'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he Oh, yeah. Almost the perfect drift. There we go. I want the uh, radio off. I'm sorry. Oh shit! Damn, you're scratching the paint. Police awareness. The police will attack if you commit crimes, act suspiciously, or break traffic laws. Within <laughs> what? Oh my god! It's just like Mafia 2, which I'm kind of happy for. Police awareness indicates by the blue police awareness indicator in the center of the screen. Oh shit, oh shit. Remember Marty and Ron Langford? Sure. They moved up to Empire Bay a year or so after you shipped out. Started selling weed. They call and ask me if I want something. I say sure. It's free money as far as I'm concerned. Anyhow, a month back, Marty drops me a line and says they're moving into heroin that they're looking for a partner down around these parts. Can't imagine. Damn, you're scratching the paint. Yeah. Anyway, can't imagine Sammy was too keen on that. I never told about the. What if you could change that? Nobody, but this I gotta talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need J Edgar up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. I like the rearview mirror. Selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with? Fucking around the side. That was pretty serious shit. Knew a couple guys over in Nam who were running it. Wound up pissing off the wrong person. Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. There's no way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgie says he can keep his old man from fighting out. We'll steer clear of the hollow in Frisco, just selling the French wall. Georgie's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, huh. man. Georgie's a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Come in on it with us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit, figure some things out. Yeah. All right. Where's the? Is this? Is that? Is is that the Bayou? I wonder. Okay. Made it. Oh wait wait. There we go. Come on, we're going through the front. I ain't having your wall here. I ask you the back door. <laughs> Look who I found panhandling out in front of the train station. Pleasure, man. Welcome back, baby. Boy, I send you to bring Lincoln Clay home. Not the big nigga who ate him. What the fuck? Oh, wait. I finally went somewhere they knew how to cook. <laughs> Welcome home, son. How are you? I'll be better once I get some of that shine in me. I always did love corn whiskey. I would like to make a toast. My father used to say that the real worth of a man came from the mark he left on the world. When Lincoln first told me he was joining the military, I was against it. Too dangerous, I say. Let those people fight their own war, I say. But then I realized Lincoln needed to go out and make his mark. And that's precisely what he did. I'm so so proud of you. Hmm. Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Yeah! <laughs> so good. Oh, that's the... Fa yeah, Father James. 
Oh, I kept you in my prayers. I really appreciate that, Father. <laughs> now, who wants to get shit faced? <laughs> Woo! It's hard to explain what it's like coming home from war. Elation, fear, guilt. Imagine being trapped in a dark room and there's no way out. And every fear, every nightmare you ever had is in that room with you. And there's no escape from any of it. And then one day a door opens and you're free to go. Just like that. <coughs> yes. You made your peace with your death. <coughs> oh, your gosh. Death. Excuse me. And now part of you is afraid to leave it behind. But what choice do you have? Every soldier has to walk through that door. One way or another. Man, that whiskey's gonna hoy in the morning. Hell, man, just sleep it off. The room's the same as he left it. I'm gonna take the basement. <laughs> the basement? Why the fuck you wanna crash down there? I'll see you in the morning. <laughs> man, that wall must have really fucked you up. <laughs> I'll be in the basement. That's my jerk off room. Leave me alone. <laughs> Actually, I take that back. Let me go back up there. So what we got? We got stove. Use the fridge? No. Come on, you can use the fridge whenever you want in, in uh, Mafia 2. Come on. You can use something to drink, man. Oh, he had too many. Look at this. All this booze I can drink, and I can't. Not giving me a chance to drink booze. That sucks. Alright, whatever. I'm really loving the music, though. I really do. This uh, old style music is freaking awesome. But sadly, I'm gonna turn it down just a tiny bit more because I don't want. Uh, yeah. I'm. I apologize, guys. There we go. I put it to five. I'll take the basement. Be sure to knock before you enter. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> I'll be sure to put up a don't disturb sign. <laughs> yes, I'll be sleeping in the basement. This is my torture room. Oh, oh I mean my jerk off room. Oh, I'm I, I, I at my uh, sleeping room. Yeah, yeah, I sleep in here. Yeah. I'm sorry. Did I mean to say that? I didn't mean to say that out loud. Da, 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 da. More liquor and paint and other stuff. Whoa, what are these? Can I watch TV? What is this? Uh, uh, I'm not gonna look. At, oh God, I'm not gonna look at it. I'm not gonna look at it. <laughs> as much as I want to, though, I'm not gonna look at it. Okay, so let's go to sleep. Jesus Christ. Oh, for a second there, I thought I heard moaning. <laughs> yes. I told you, knock before you enter, damn it! What the hell? Talk to Sammy and Ellis. What'd I say? Oh.
I don't want to talk to him. I want to watch. I want to read more porn. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. We barely have two nickels to rub together. Now we're paying for all that food. Jesus Christ! Watch that mouth of yours. We wouldn't be in this mess if you were to listen to me. What mess? Uh oh. Not something you need to worry about, Linka. I got it under control. Under control? God damn it, you need to. Boy, I'm not warning you again. Have it your way, old man. Let him be. He needs to cool off. Hmm. What's Mind telling me what's got him so riled up? We've been having uh, problems with the Haitians. But like I say, I got it under control. Well, trucks all loaded up. I figure we got enough out there for. Should I? Should I come back? <laughs> In honor of your returning to us safe and sound, I made a donation to Father James here. Supplied him with food he can hand out to some of our needier family. Well, I was hoping you'd lend me a hand, Lincoln, and give you a chance to see the neighborhood. This thing with the Haitians, how serious is it? Ah, you know Ellis. Someone looks at him the wrong way, he's on them like a wet dog. Like I said, I can now uh, come back. Nonsense. Lincoln needs to get out. Enjoy the day. Besides, be good for the two of you to spend some time together. Mm. <laughs> Gone. Those people waiting on their food. Yes. Oh, I saw Langan a couple times once he was first back. <laughs> he told me he wanted to leave town, head out to California. Ooh. Now, he had a friend in the service who could get him a job working at the Mare Island shipyard. Ooh. And the only reason he came back was to tell Sammy and Ellis goodbye. But then he found out about the trouble Sammy was having with those Haitians. So he decided to stay in hell. Those Haitians, they are bad news. No talking Lankin out of it. Whatever else he might have become, Lankin was always loyal. Damn straight. Loyalty! Warm Hearts, uh, Neighborhood Kitchen, February 21st, 1968, six days before the... Oh, come on! Well, then most likely. Three-month apprenticeship to start, then the union lets you in. You tell Sammy and Ellis? Not yet. Gonna wait a few days. Didn't want to spring it on them since I just got back. Well, they won't like the head, but they'll come around. You need to do what's best for you. Go ahead and start serving those folks. I'll be back. Okay. Ooh, record. Nice. Serve the gumbo. Ooh, gumbo. I never actually had gumbo. Give Sammy my best, Lincoln. Yes, sir. Warm meal, warm heart. Oh, sure. Get no indicator for uh, putting. Oh, whoops. I made him wait for a while. My bad. I didn't see. I didn't see a uh, square indicator right, right below there. Here you go. You delivering a real blessing here, Lincoln. Thank you. No problem. Blessings mine, ma'am. No problem. A couple of days back, and they already got you working. Ah, I'm happy to do it. Dick. Kidding. Kidding. Means a hell of a lot to all of us. Nice. Don't get old, son. It's a fucking shit show. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see what I can do about that. Don't get old. It's a freaking shit show. How are you, Regine? I'm good. Nice to see you around the hollow again. It's nice to see those big brown eyes again. Well, they'll be over at my aunt's place with the rest of me. You should stop by. Maybe I'll do that. Megan, we got trouble. Run, Regine. What? Uh oh. Once they we're done with you, Lincoln. Oh! Left stick and triangle. Ooh. Ah! 
Oh, what the? Oh my god, we're on the fucking table! Oh ho 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 ho! Oh ho 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 no! Ah! Fucking almost like a rock bottom on the table, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Look at Clay, WWE champion! Ladies and gentlemen! Right on the fucking table! Ow! What the hell? Francois. Papa Doc Duvalier was elected president of Haiti in 1957. By 1959, he had created a secret police called Tonton Makut, and people started to flee. Uh, most of them settled in the southern United States. Now, mixed in with the good, hard-working people were hardened criminals. Uh, they formed the backbone of what became the Haitian gang. Now, Lincoln found out they set up in the swamps and were led by a man named Baca. Uh. You and Father James done already? We got jumped by the Haitians. It's time you level with me. Tell me what's really going on. Yes. I suppose it is. Oh, shit. Six, sir. Seven months ago, folks in the hollow started getting robbed. Money, jewelry, things of that nature. Didn't take long for us to figure out it was the Haitians. Then those batas on Velour started going after the lottery. How much money are we talking about? How much? Enough that we're in deep shit with Sal Marcano. Haven't kicked up to him in three months. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. If I deal with them, that gives us time to settle up with Marcano, right? Let me worry about Sal. He and I go way back. With this thing with the Haitians. It's time for it to end. Damn straight, let's go. You and Ellis need to handle it. Fuck yeah. How we gonna find him? Back in the 20s, folks used to pull salt out of the bayou. They even built themselves a little shanty town. When the depression hit, they abandoned it. That's the only place this could have come from. We're gonna need guns and ammo. Call this number. Do it away from here. No sense tipping anybody off. Yeah. Or we could sweep the hollow, track down and kill every last one of those cocksuckers, then we wouldn't have to worry about it. The last thing folks in this neighborhood need to see is colored people killing each other. Do this quiet. Away from here. Hmm. Once we eliminate whoever's running the show, the rest of them will go down on their own. Trust me. All right, soldier boy. I'll follow your lead. Be careful, here. Yeah? Those Haitians are a hard people. Do not ever underestimate them. God damn, this soundtrack is so bad ass. <laughs> uh... just said I'm sorry but I'm really loving the game so far oh shit you sure this is how you want to play this last thing they're gonna expect is an attack from the water you head back round to the road oh guys so see call. a fucking alligator there when this is done hope you know what you're doing trust me Ellis here in a bit this will all be behind us Swim! Fucking alligators here! Are you crazy? Swim fast, Lincoln. Swim fast, Lincoln. Swim fast, Lincoln. Swim fast, Lincoln. Swim for your life, Lincoln. Uh. Oh. Triangles climb. Thank God. How many men we send? Two teams. One's gonna hit the bar. Yeah. What well, the intention enemy one is is shown by the white indicator in the center of the screen. Just like the cops. Get too close or make noise and the enemy awareness indicator will expand and they'll come looking for you. When you're stalking, you'll make less noise and stay out of enemy's line of sight. 
While enemies are looking for you, stay in cover. When they they've spotted, uh, stop looking. The enemy awareness indicator will disappear. Okay. Is going after Perlis. Boss says if we have to burn down half the hollow to get to Sammy, we're doing it. And stop. Papa Legba, who been dig? No one. Lincoln Clay. He's the one. This time you won't get away from us. Huh. I seen this in the trailer, so I want to see if it works. Cause I see an alligator right there. Just gonna wait. Okay. <laughs> bon appetit, alligator. Bon appetit. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh God. Shit. There's two of them right there. Now you can either go in guns blazing or play the smart and silent. I I can kind of, I kind of do both. I can go silent if I have to, but I mostly want to go gun, go in guns blazing. But right now I'm going to do this silently. Fall, 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 fall. There you go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh! Oops. I almost fucked up right there. Uh. Oh, there we go. Enjoy! Pick up the shotgun. Only three shells. What the fuck? Oops. <laughs> What's even weird is I pressed press, uh, triangle for vault and climbing. Whistling. Hold left, I'm guessing. Uh -oh. Think the boss was worried Sammy didn't bother Marcano. Ask him to come down on us. Shit, there's another guy over there, though. I'm. F <coughs> um. That guy just completely ignored the fucking. The guy just ignored. <laughs> oh my god. He just ignored the, the fucking. He he, <laughs> he didn't he didn't even care if I was choking the crap out of his buddy. I was like, huh? Oh, oh no, what that is. Oh, I'm just gonna go back to sleep, or I'm just gonna go fuck around. My enemies, man. Oh my god. Oh yeah, here we go. What the? I have to wait for the freaking uh, the indicator to pop up like that. That sucks. Oh, whatever. Ooh, nice. Extra ammo for my shotgun. Oh, crap. Oh, he see me. Fuck this. Good place it is! I was itching for a gun, uh, uh, gunfight anyways. So this is perfect. I don't care. Shit, 
<laughs> Shit, I'm taking cover. Oh, I want to do a freaking takedown on them. Whatever. It's shotgun time. It's shotgun time. Oh! Oh! You're next. Ooh! I want to freaking use shoot him. I guess he has a brutal takedown. I can't do that yet. These are just regular takedowns. I'm guessing. Climbing ladders, a triangle. Yep. Okay, he doesn't have to use the ladder. Just fucking climb up there. Okay. Ow! I hear a guy with the Tommy. Hello. Oh, too short. That's okay. Ah, oh, just punch the bastard. Oh, I see another medicine cabinet. I need that just in case. There we go. Got two of them. Nice. Oh crap. Ow. Hello. Oh shit, this is automatic? I didn't know it was automatic. Where are you going? Bullshit. Oh fuck. Are right, good. You regenerate your health. That's good. I saw a freaking revolver. Oh yeah. Ooh. With your people come. Oh god, one bullet. Is that that's all it takes. Shit, this gun's powerful. I need more ammo for it though. All right, Sergi Baka. Not kidding. I'm kidding. Tom, uh, Thompson. Nah, I have like 12 shells in this, so I'm good. Three uh, medicine packs or adrenaline packs. Oh crap! Fuck you! You come to take my life. But no, I do see. Should have killed me when you had the chance, asshole. That's right. Now I beat the shit out of you. Fuck you! Who violent Fuck you! You made a big mistake going after the hollow. The man you're talking about took me in where I had nowhere else to go. You are no better than you. Ooh! Fuck! Snap his neck! Whoa. You can't take those shows! You fucking pig! Damn you to earth! Take it easy! Take it easy! Take it oh, Cassandra! Easy. He kept me in there, locked in there, day and night. Beat me, use me! I killed you, motherfucker! Whoa! He's dead! He's dead! He can't hurt you anymore. It's over. Don't worry, he snapped his neck. Over. Over. <laughs> this is never going to be over. Pajam! Fucking Haitians. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh god, tons of Molotovs. How do I throw Molotovs? Oh, here we go. R1? Oh, snap! Oh, fuck! 
Yep, Molotovs and grenades, hold LR1, then release, circle to cancel, gotcha. I pressed it and now I just fucked myself. Oh, look at that. Oh, you can only carry three? That sucks. Holy shit. Enjoy this, assholes. We got a firebomb. Let me at this fucker. Mass. Firebomb that fucker! <laughs> Firebomb that fucker! How about that? Huh? Oh god, now I'm on fire! Oh shit! Yeah! Okay, I'm sorry. Oh crap! Bad idea! Bad idea! Bad idea! Bad idea! Bad fucking idea! And I'm dead. Okay, that was stupid of me. I went out there in the open and I caught on fire. That's my fault. Well, sh